Christina Universe Citizen presents New Era Religion, Episode 5, March 15, 2022. Awareness of All Space Filling, continued from Episode 4. Relevant links will be provided. You can read the entire transcript on my website, New Era Religion dot online. We can always attempt to clarify our lay perspective regarding this generalized content of information in Synergetics 1006.13 because it is new to most of us and perhaps the world's renowned physicists whose education did not accredit our Buckminster Fuller's discoveries that are not yet obsolete, as is the PRJWBCS, politics, religion, justice, war, belief complex schemes, when our interest in the universal communication process includes the potential realization of reducing the tolerance magnitudes of the residual inaccuracies. Inaccuracies are the articulations that omit by default conditioning and education programming the generalized principles, the generalized laws, the generalizations that are of the mind and are omni-embracing and omnipermeative as Fuller noted in Radiation Gravitation, March 8, 1973, in the Arbuckminster Fuller Synergetics Dictionary. From Synergetics 162, March 13, 1973, 49 years ago, and still wholly, W-H-O-L-L-Y, relevant to our anticipatory design science realities. The eternal generalizations embrace a plurality of generalizations. So we ought to know of generalizations in our everyday speech as a mathematical use of this word, not the literary use of generalization, those generalities that are said to be in principle having no specific validity or force, but influences self and the other's observations without factoring in the essentiality of reducing the tolerance magnitude of the residual inaccuracy of the reenacting articulations. In literature, the word generalization usually means covering too much territory, too thinly to be convincing. Fuller writes of this in his book, Brain and Mind, page 136, May 1972. I could not find a link to this book online today, so probably it is no longer available from those resources. As if humans exist to be persuaded by contradictory articulations. A generalized principle is vastly different from what is said to be a principle, but actually is a false premise. A generalized principle holds true in every case. False premises throw us a loop involving our individual intellection in a vortex of reiterating nonsense. All generalized principles are interaccommodating. Not one generalized principle can contradict another generalized principle, because if such potential exists, it is no longer a generalized principle. Synergetics 220.04. When it comes to the difference between generalization and special case, it is noteworthy that special case is always time size, physical as frequencies are but that the generalization involves metaphysical intellect 
as a function of universe when of a mind consciously coordinates thought language mindfully of spheres and spaces wave and particle definability unstructuring and restructuring angle and frequency design control among relevant conceptualities in our buckminster fuller synergetics dictionary and explorations in synergetics online in synergetics 515.12 through point one three apparently Humans can employ nature's basic designing tools. This means only generalized angles and special case frequencies. Quite then, it may dawn on the human imagination that instead of expecting to be visited by aliens, we can wonder about the cycles of relative experience timing from anywhere that a mind can go in an angular direction before the mind in the matter changes the angle of direction during the system describing operations complex of wave angles and line frequencies might be scanned transmitting from here to anywhere by radio implying that it is not the alien but the increasingly more familiar use of the language of nature where angles and frequencies constitute the only two possible covariables that are operatives in all universe design. This means the design of us, our evolution species, humans of a mind, which very well may be young, U-E-O-M, because universal, eternal, omniscient mind is not the god of the prgwbcs which has held our consciousness awareness in a type of bondage knowing nothing of chemical bonds not correlating thought and language to degrees of freedom and bonding gravity and bonding omnicongruent self-congruent packing valence and valent who knew that chemistry is another term for valency before looking into the word valence in Oxford University Press Dictionary and Thesaurus or recalling that as life vanishes at the moment of death when no weight is lost and only the chemistry remain. This process naturally questions any false claims that historically misinform humans of impossible occurrences that are promoted as God to promise comfort, which usually is a compromised position, or as the atheist is not satisfied until a logical correlation may someday come to mind, questioning and perhaps answering all those as yet to be explored and explained referentially to the generalized principle. The idea of generalized principles is new to most of us. We have yet to be informed that universe is the aggregate of all the generalized principles. So you'd think this information must be fundamental, especially concerning stability and generalized law as well as general system awareness because if the systems are stable, they are inherent to all generalized law. It may turn out to be that the J factor of the PRJWBCS, politics, religion, justice, war, belief, complex schemes, was always duplicitous. Simply because it professes knowledge regarding behavior but historically, it does not produce more stability. And this could simply be because it emanates from a differently conceived and perceived coordinate system. Awareness of our individuality and degrees of recognizable freedom emanates from nature's coordinate system, first off. This requires differentiations of the individual as the special case, but consciousness as the generalization. This brings us back to Synergetics 537.41.
where the 12 vectorial degrees of freedom are the six positive and six negative vectors of the minimum structural system of universe, the energy events geometry and topology, and the vector equilibrium as an empty set tetrahedron. In other words, our individual position in universe is an individual differentiation, and we differentiate self as a mind of the eternal omniscient mind. We cannot accurately call this mind God, uppercase G, God, lowercase G, or any sound word God in any language spoken anywhere on earth because the belief systems that promote that concept have never referred to a difference between reality and generalization. Since there is only one generalization, and consciousness is the generalization differentiated from the special case physical time size frequencies of the manifest form we can learn more about it please leave relevant comments reading them is at my discretion thank you